Hey everyone, welcome back to RimWorld, and uh, I guess uh, let's get going at what was going on before. I'm finding advice in the comments to be very conflicting. As I said, someone told me to go and capture Witchel, and now it's become inc increasingly inconvenient, so now I can't really trust anybody's advice anymore, so I guess I'm just going to do my own thing for the most part. Um, and I mean, there's like a, not, a lot of nitpicking, like I don't do things perfectly the way, like, in terms of room size and stuff, like, come on, guys. It's not exactly, like, a big deal. Pick your battles, you know? Anyways, I'm, uh... I'm thinking of the work... Oh, there's the stonecutter's table. I'm just gonna keep it inside, I don't care. Someone suggested to put it outside, and now I just don't care. What kind of uh, stone blocks do we want, though, is the question. Uh, slate chunks. Stand what do we have in this area, anyways? Um, ah, oh, slate. We get like tons of slate. Actually, we can do. We can do just slate then, just so we have like one consistent type of wall. So clear all, but allow slate. I think it's necromantic cat that's gonna do that. But I'm gonna set his. Is it crafting? I think it's crafting. Yeah, I would prefer him to do hauling rather than anything else. Like, he doesn't need to do tailoring, really. I mean, he's okay at it. And his smithing is okay, too. I'm sure you can have that on three. The tailoring, no. What the fuck happened to the, the rock? Whatever, no one cares. Tur tons of joy. Nice, alright. <clears throat> Everyone's doing really well. Um, <clears throat> I have like something in my throat. Fucking hell. Alright, that's much better. Um, alright. We are very low on health kits, but there's really not much we can do about that. Wow, we just like made all the food into actual meals. Insane. Uh, what the hell is Ken doing here? I, d d does he really? Well, he has something to construct. What? You need materials. I guess, uh, we need to be, uh,. I guess we don't have enough, uh, I'm gonna guess we have absolutely nothing in terms of... No, we have plenty of silver. What the hell does this still need? Pl oh, plasteel. Oh, we should maybe have a look around to see if we have any of that here. Uh, that's kind of a big deal. I didn't think about that. I mean, there's ways us, for us to get, um, uh, plasteel through deep, deep, dr uh, deep drilling, but, uh... <clears throat> um... It would be nice if there was like a nice little uh, foundation of it somewhere. Steel slag junks. Um, yeah. I don't know where to get that from. <clears throat> um, yeah, I just can't get rid of it. It's getting worse. Okay, maybe I'm better now. All right. Uh, you know that feeling when, I don't know, I think I was eating something and then like something fluffy and then it's like, yeah. You know what? I'm not even going to describe that at all. Feeding a simple meal to Witchel. Alright. Making pants. How about you prioritize, prioritize hauling that? Because that's a free meal right there. What's this, uh, what's with the graphics on this thing? Like, uh, like some of it looks fine, but some of it isn't foggy. I'm going to guess it's a glitch. Yeah, so... We have a bit of a problem with uh, with regards to plasteel, and the problem is that there aren't there isn't any. <clears throat> There's jade here, and we can mine some of that, I guess. I think that's worth something. The issue here is though is since we don't have any here, right? Um, like we have no way, we have no recourse. Like, uh, like the the deep drilling requires this this item, and I don't have any plasteel, so what the fuck am I supposed to do? We have to either trade it with someone or something else. I actually didn't quite take this into account. So, here's the plan. We're gonna... I, I don't wanna... We can call a caravan. We can do that. I don't wanna... That's like my fucking last resort, though. I'm gonna tell you that right now. Uh, cause I, I don't really want to be doing that. Because doing that means someone has to come down here. I want to see what's in there, so I'm going to mine that out, too. Because we're going to open that wall up. 
Okay. Let's let's just work on the priority stuff right now for that for that mining. And I think I'm the miner here. That would be correct I am. And it is my highest priority thing below uh, hunting, so <clears throat> that's pretty good. Oh yeah, we have this now battery compartment now ready here. We can uh, haul these away. Question: uh, I should just multi-select them. I don't know why I'm doing it the, the bad way. All right. Um, next thing's next is we're gonna make a nice wall here. I think. Uh. I mean, I guess I, I guess I could just have a door here, you know, kind of like this. And then the way we're gonna handle this is, whoops, I'm gonna minimize the desktop. Where my bad? Went to desktop instead. Um, just click outside of it. Okay, so we have now kind of like a circuit kind of coming around here. So I'm gonna make a power switch right here and a power switch, let's say, where I'm actually not sure if I can just kind of travel over it, but we'll see, I guess. And then we'll, we'll make a battery here, battery here, battery here. Okay. This is gonna be kind of our our alternate kind of circuit route here. We're making fire foam. So we'll just speed this guy up. The candle will make all of the shit that we need here. And well, I'll, I'll show you how this works. It's actually gonna be great. So, um, when it, whenever we have whenever we have kind of power issues, um, they happen because the and the batteries get drained during those moments too. So it's like it's not exactly great stuff. Um, okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna toggle this power off, um, and then we're gonna designate this one to be reinstalled over here. Okay, so if we actually look at the power conduits, you can see that they're. They're connected, but this one is not connected, which is on purpose. We don't want it to be connected. Okay, and Canada's bringing around the battery. We're going to deconstruct this crap here. Deconstruct that guy too. Actually, we need to deconstruct all of this. We don't need these cables anymore. Because now it's kind of hooked up. So you can see these two batteries are charging. This is obviously, as I said, this is intentional. Uh, we're just going to have that going all the time. Now we have fire foam. Most construction of uh, fire foam poppers, safety, uh, fire safety buildings, which uh, spread. Okay, good. Now knowing that we cannot, uh, maybe, maybe, maybe we can. Um, uh, no, I don't need. Uh, what the hell? Witchell's gone totally berserk. Isn't he in jail, anyways? Okay, he's just going to fight this guy. Um. Uh, oh. Okay, I think Witchell's gonna die now. Okay, there we go. Uh, rescue Witchell. Can you rescue Witchell? Do you not care? Okay, apparently we can't rescue. Okay, we're gonna capture him. What the fuck? Oh, I think, I think this is, um, the door broke. Uh, yeah, that's a problem. Okay, I want to just mention that listening to the guy who said to, to fucking do the thing with Witchell, uh, is causing me nothing but trouble. Okay, now we have fucking, now we have these issues. Uh, okay, we're capturing that guy. Got a mad animal. Uh, where is me right now? Okay, I'm right there. Let's uh, prioritize hunting this doe. Actually, we don't really need to do that, do we? He's just gonna kind of come over here. But yeah, if we both take shots at it, it's gonna be great. There we go, it's dead. Do you do you not want to like prioritize hauling? Yeah, thank you very much. Pepe is fully healed. And we have like two of these fucking hide shirts and shit like that. That's not bad. 
Yeah, unfortunately, it looks like we're using more of the battery than we are draining it. That's uh, good times. Cotton almost done, maybe. Heal root is uh, 52%. Corn's coming along too. Oh, smoke leaf. It's the best things. Yeah, so what are we still wearing that's kind of tattered, I wonder? So he's got like, um, I guess a jacket, some t-shirts, and some, some toques, I guess. Uh, yeah, we got some, where, where's jackets? There we go. Get some jackets out. Oh, we're still trying to make cowboy hats, too, on top of that. So I'm just telling them to do it a couple times. Oh, there's Master Fiddle. Apparently even that sleeping bag. Is this guy good for health? Yeah, I guess so. I mean, it's like, very joy deprived, rebuffed by Wiki. What the fuck is all this shit? I feel like I should just like take out his liver just to teach him a lesson. We got a raid. Uh, tribes people, fuck. All right. Uh, where are they going after right now? Malay attacking ancient crowd sleeps casket. Great, all hands on deck now. Pat's not going to do anything. This is a lot of people, actually. Uh, who else is available? Can put Wiki Doo there. Ship a motherfucker there. All right, this is going to be, I think, a multifaceted uh, engagement here. All right, so these two are are coming up here. All right, let's bring these guys over here. They seem to just have melee weapons, so that's going to be kind of nice. I think Master Fiddle's actually going to come over here with a shotgun. All right, we got a. Who the hell is this guy? He's attacking Pepe. Ah, they're retreating. Okay, that was actually an easier attack than I thought it would be. All right, we'll strip that guy. Good thing Witchell's in here to help us out, you know. Um, can we actually capture him? Uh, we need another bed for them for him. So this guy we're gonna capture and free once again, just because. Uh, whatever. This is getting really full. This place. Where's Wix at? Ah, oh, there he is. Oh wait, wait, he had a release animals. Oh. We have that option. Oh, wait, 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 he's, this guy's alive. Oh, I didn't realize that. Okay, looks like we're gonna need more beds. Uh, yeah, we kind of took his clothes. The cat is reserving that one. All right, let's go say, um, capture this guy. Where's Kanda right now? Are you for fucking real? He's like calling it from all the way down there. Well, it's not like that guy's waiting. Like he's just fucking whatever. Yeah, no, he's just, he's just right here, you know. He's just hanging out. Uh, we should also kind of unforbidden these items. Okay, like fucking just just build. And we're gonna capture this guy. We can we can carry him to a crowd sleep at Casca, but we have no need for that. All right, so for these two guys, uh, we're gonna set them free immediately after their um, because I'd kind of want that that tribal place to stop attacking me, because they're from the Lyra of Stingray. As I said, as long as they're not pirates, we can make them happy for me. So you know, you never know what they may have. That's Witchell's problem. And we have to recruit him again. Wonderful. All he does is cause issues anyways. Oh. Well, the, the boar took a crack at trying to fix that up and wasn't able to. So, we, as I said, we can't call a, uh, a, like a, one of the people to send a trader over, but... Because we just need the Plasteel, which is a certain resource which doesn't appear to be on the map. 
Um, just kind of one of those unfortunate things, you know. And apparently, by me claiming these cryosleep caskets, they, they will sometimes come after them and try and attack them. So what we're probably gonna do is we're actually gonna probably break them all apart. But this is when we once we get the defensive walls up here go up and running. Oh, look, there goes Barrow. Okay, what the fuck's wrong with him? Hypothermia. He's got hypothermia? Uh, I guess this room isn't exactly uh, insulated. <laughs> he took off all his clothes. I thought he was dead, I'm sorry. Alright, you know what? I, I need to actually do something. It just occurred to me. To make these batteries charge up faster, we're gonna actually toggle the power on these. Because we need these power, these batteries to charge up, then we, then we change the circuit. And that's the idea, is that we have two batteries that are full all the time. You guys aren't leaving. With he a healthy, re uh, so the relations with sta uh, that place is risen by 15, so now they're negative 41 hostile. We can also contact them and give them shit, but you know, I'm not giving them anything. Fuck them. They don't get free materials. I think it's actually a good idea maybe we, that we get another solar power uh, generation going. Maybe like this. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. We'll do that. Just to minimize the Bill Complete Make T-shirt. Okay, we keep moving all the T-shirts here. Oh, there you go, alpaca. Okay, we got some. We got some nice fur T-shirts. Ostrich leather cowboy hat. So now people that are wearing tattered apparel like Pat, like what the fuck can you wear? Okay, I'm, I maybe have to say he's not forced to do it. He's, why does he have a parka on? Fuck. Because that's like for extreme cold. That's like like if you're in like the north. Whatever, we'll just make a couple of these. Is that like, we're in a situation where you can have like heat stroke and shit, you know? But this shouldn't reduce his uh, thing too much. All right, here's the place I was thinking of. And there was obviously nothing there of any interest whatsoever. The saddest thing I've ever seen. And there's some more compacted steel over here, which we will get to. And then compacted machinery. We've got a ton of that, so components are never going to be an issue here for us. Well, I wouldn't say never going to be an issue, but you know, very unlikely to be an issue. Never say never, you know. Uh, which we got poisoning. My heart bleeds. <laughs> We're just in the doorway. See, which you too could have fun, you know, just fucking. Is, is this is this even worth the name where? For him. I, actually, he's good at medicine. <laughs> he's just throwing up here. Yeah, the batteries are still going. As I said, I liked having two of each on these circuits, you know. Compact machinery once again. Maybe, maybe what we'll do is we'll uh, have a look at who we can... Yeah, so we can... This is all the people we can call. So we can ask for a trader, but that that would cost silver, which we have an abundance of, but I prefer if someone just comes on their own volition, you know? What, what kind of stones do we have? Oh yeah, we were going to make slate blocks. Oh yeah, here we go. Uh, do until you have... How many do we need? Maybe like up to 200 and something. Cold snap, all right. Watch out for hypothermia and dying crops. Well, you know what? There's honestly nothing we can really do about that uh, besides have this indoors, but it would be lacking in the uh, sunlight department, which we can, you know, you can make sunlight happen, but it's still not nice. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Mike Lott needs uh, treatment from what? Oh, from this? Oh, someone, else, someone will deal with that. All right, we need a research project though. What else do we need? Auto doors? I don't know, maybe. A uh, hospital bed? No. Geothermal power? No. IDEs? Maybe. Machining? Uh, unable to c craft guns and machinery or disassemble de uh, dead mechanoids? Well, we don't know any mechanoids, so that's no. Uh, carpet? No. 
Tube television, maybe. Uh, hydroponics, no. Brewing. <laughs> Do we want to make uh, some hops and some beer? That's a, that's a good question. No, no colored lights. Uh, getting rid of unwanted uh, corpses actually would be good because I'm tired of making these fucking things right here. Actually, what happened to the last corpse I just had? Yeah, because we, we seem to have like fucking a shit ton of corpses. I'm not going to lie. I'm not I'm not a proud man with regards to that. Well, we are going to start working on this. Um, we're going to build a wall around our little place here. Actually, would these have plasteel in them, do you think? Let's let's deconstruct some of them actually. Actually, maybe not that one, but start with that one. I think it's just silver. All right, so this guy doesn't want to join us yet. Yeah, just keep giving fucking Witchel food there. Oh, yeah, 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 see. Uranium and steel. Well, the, the problem is fundamentally that, like, these things don't do anything for me right now, I think. Because I can't move them, I can't... The thing I can keep them around for is to potentially save someone, but... I don't know. I, I haven't quite decided that yet. Outdoors, it's pretty cold. Actually, indoors is pretty cold, too, to be honest. It's like five degrees indoors. Maybe we need more heaters. Let's uh, let's make that happen, guys. Two more heaters. Well, we're also working on solar power. Oh well, there goes all our crops. All of it's dead. As I said, nothing nothing you can do really. It's winter. Like, what are you gonna do about it? Uh, nothing. So, we just have to wait on it, I guess. I wonder what, uh, he's jealous. Why? Someone has a more impressive bedroom. Who the fuck has a more impressive bedroom than you? Son of a bitch. Like, like what? The one with the double bed? Like, fuck. Slept in the cold, yeah. Well, we're gonna... That's what we have Parker's now. We, we need materials for this. Component and steel. We don't have steel, do we? Oh, well, we have plenty of steel here, so... Let's, uh... Mind that up, then. I didn't think that... I didn't think we actually ran out of that already. Uh, yeah, we have 52, so we did run out, actually. Well, okay, we didn't technically run out, but we do need a bit more. And we are actually out of health uh, equipment now. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna send someone over. All right, let's call. Who would be the person that would have the resources for us? Gardeners, I guess, would do it. So, uh, offer gift or request a trade. We're gonna request a trade uh, caravan. Um, we're gonna get a bulk goods trader because I think that's what we want. It will arrive in a couple days. All right, disconnect. Kind of one of those unfortunate things. And unfortunately, I'm going to have to help deal with this. Let's work on the heaters right now. I'm going to get that, I think. Major break risk for who? For Pat? That's Pat's problem. Like, Pat's, like, inside all the time. Like, he's got, like, nothing wrong with him. Mental... Okay, witch has gone berserk. Oh, fuck. Uh, witch has been beaten to death. Alright. Well, he's dead. So, instead of, uh, you know, having a normal person, uh, you know, like, fucking dealing with these this shit normally, we actually got someone killed because of, uh, their fucking mental issues. Like, the place they're in, fine. It's not the best in the world, but seriously, though. Yeah, that was some really shit advice I got, let me tell you that. Uh, what could you as accept a necromantic cat's marriage proposal? Uh, at some point in the coming days of the season, they will have their marriage ceremony uh, and invite all the colonists. Alright. You know, I've never tried to actually arrest someone, and then, like, yeah, the first time I do it, it's like, it's, oh my god, Pat's gonna break ahead and break a. My friend Witchell died. Observed a corpse. Where? 
What? Was that Jack? Oh, we're fucking trying to bury it. What the fuck? Dude, just fucking work on the this shit. And bury him. There we go. Like, we used a lot of good health packs on him. It was a total fucking waste. Alright, so this is going to maintain 21. Actually, this, is, this, this one's going to maintain 20. They're like, uh, no, it's it's not like, there's no problem with, um... Yeah, this is going to be 21. Is this just not working that well? Yeah, current power use high. The... The air conditioners will not work because they don't need to right now. This place is negative eight degrees in this in this uh, freezer. It's great. Get, don't get freezer burn or something. And I'm still seeing like a huge variance in the temperature inside opposed to outside, which I find to be weird. Uh, I guess we'll make two more or something. I don't know what the solution here is. Yeah, let's just make two more. Like it's it's going up now, but it wasn't working before, so. It would also be nice. Fucking Plastdale would be nice. Ah, it's like yeah, we're we're truly in winter now. Alright. We're gonna have to do some hunting because we just lost all our crops, unfortunately. So let's see uh, what's around here. Unless everything went decided to go south for the winter. Well, there's something here. There's also some bears here, but they're uh they're okay on food. Prioritize hauling that guy. I mean yeah, there's bears, so okay. We may have to take these guys out, yeah, especially this guy, I think. Um I mean, some deer here. Yeah, so the problem with bears is once they get hungry, they start looking for food. And, um, you know, people count as food, uh, if you didn't know that. But we're going to hunt this hare, actually. We can actually hunt a whole bunch of these animals. I didn't think we'd get knee-deep in winter this, this fucking early. Well, actually, I don't know what I was thinking, actually, because it's uh, literally, literally winter now. He's like, look at him, he's like after the graves. Got him. Look at that, Ken can actually, uh... He can actually mine things, nice. All those hours of Minecraft paid off. There's actually like a ton of, uh... Mining that we can do here. Minor break risk for canned and uh, well, it's just a more sleeping the cold kind of shit. But now it's actually good inside now. The temperature is fine. I mean, there's a, like a like a three degree difference between the main rooms and the all the bedrooms. So uh, an easy way of fixing that though is to make um, these heaters. Whoops, uh, these heaters do go like twenty three degrees, let's say. So they work a little bit harder. Maybe this one too, 23. Reason I want them to work a little bit harder. If it's, t if it's a few degrees hotter here, it's gonna be a few degrees warmer in that room as well, so. It's just that the heat transfer with the vents are not one to one. So that's kind of how that works. Uh, I wish we could make more kibble, but we really can't. We kind of need this guy to join our colony because we lost Witchell to fucking bad advice. Horrible, horrible, <laughs> horrible thing to lose. He's apparently a, a psychopath and an optimist. Huh. A psychopathic optimist. That's um definitely one of the more interesting combos I've ever seen. All right, here we go. See the batteries? Almost full. Not quite full, but they're almost full. We actually go. We actually might make like another um, solar power generator. Actually. Yeah, you know I'm up for that. It's just to it's just to keep those batteries full during the day, and then I swap them over, and then we have a another power thing. Trust me, there it's incredibly useful to do it. I've learned. What's this guy? 
A psychic smooth pulser. Gives a temporary mood boost to everyone on the map. Okay. Well, we'll save that for a rainy day. What's this? We got go juice? Yeah, we probably don't want that. Enhances movement speed. Yeah, we're gonna sell that to the guy that comes down. I can tell you that right now. Oh, and this is... Oh, shit. That's, that's what I was afraid of. Alright. So normally, this is why I trade the circuits around. It's because of shit like this. This counts in my, my home zone, right? Yeah, okay. Beating fire out. Alright, we're good. Yeah, this is, um... This is unfortunate. Alright, we're gonna have to turn off some things. Toggle power here. Toggle power here. We don't, we're not cooking anything, so we can toggle that too. Yeah, we, because of, because of, oh, actually, wait, I just, it just occurred to me, this is not, this is not hooked up. That is actually a priority thing. Uh, because I'm like, I'm like, think something should definitely be hooked up here. Okay, we're good now. 